In today's events, this takes me to this scripture, Matthew 24, 38, and it says, For in the days before the flood, people were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage up to the day of Noah entered the ark. And what is that statement saying to us? It is saying in the days of Noah, when he was telling the people, and they laughed at him. They thought he was crazy and all these sort of things because he was warning them, right? It's the same today. If you notice everything that's taking place, what is happening, we are in revelation and it's playing out right before our eyes. Look at everything. People are not taking heed. They are still on TikTok acting a fool. These pastors and these Christians still want to make money off of God's name. You got kids out here so rebellious and parents just don't care. You got kids. It is so okay. Everybody is still doing what they're doing and not taking heed to the signs from the things that are happening, from true hearted Christians that are warning. But here's the thing. We are so close that people don't realize until that day comes, until that flood comes, but until that day Will Christ come back? Or and for that day, for them, when their time has expired, or when it really hits the fan, they're not going to know what to do because they will be so blinded because they've just been doing what they're doing and not taking heed. And parents is not allowing their children to learn the Bible upon things that are happening. People are not really teaching the revelations that's in the Bible. People are not talking about the end times. People are still talking about t trending topics with Diddy still and all these other idiotic uh, trending posts that are happening, but people are not understanding the signs and the times that we are in. We are headed for destruction. Get ready. People was like, ah, Iran, they just attacked. Oh, this war with, with Iran and, and Israel, all these things. The Bible said it would be wars and rumors of war. All these things must take place. But why people are so frantic and why people are so shocked and surprised? Because they don't understand what the Bible has already told us. Get prepared. Not for what the world wants you to get prepared, but get prepared upon what the Bible has told us to get prepared for because we have preparation for the day when our Lord comes back and you have to be ready because he will come like a thief in the night. The signs are already untold you, but you're just not listening.